Hey, buggies. It is me, Jesse D. How are you? I hope you're doing alright because I'm still getting better, and that is a good thing. So, while this would normally be a just another update video, I wanted to make this really quick to just go back over the future of the channels I host, which are this one right here, Jesterday Rama, Total Gamiax, and My Little Buggy. What's going to be happening with the Jesterday Rama channel is that it will act like a springboard for a lot of different subjects of the general variety. What that means is there will be scripted videos such as comedy or otherwise that will be planned, written, and acted out. But that probably won't be a thing until after I move to Illinois at, at the beginning of August. But yeah, skits and sketches will be a thing because, you know, this is kind of a sketchpad channel where it's my personal place to say, hey, here's what's going on and here's what's coming up. But, yeah, that's kind of under the line of what's going to be with status videos and general announcements. So, any, like, general announcements saying, hey, this is going on, I will let you guys know through YouTube. And that's basically giving you the status of what's going on. But, I will also be sure to announce any stream announcements moving forward, so that way you guys know when I'm streaming a game or doing editing. And I will also start working on making sure anytime I do a stream announcement, it'll also be uh, mirrored on the appropriate secondary channel, like Total Gamiax. So if I was going to say, hey, I'm doing a gaming stream, I would say that here and on the Total Gamiax channel. But other than that, I will be planning on making commentaries on different subjects, whether they be general, political, or social. So that's to be figured out as I go and as I learn. So that way I can know, okay, this is what's the most appropriate based on the research I've looked into. So that is basically it for the Jester De Rama channel. For the Total Gamey X channel, to let you guys know again, it will be a more gaming-centric channel for a lot of gaming genre videos. So that would include Let's Plays, which would be of me or with friends, like doing group plays or co-op. Those would be things that would go on the channel. And I would also be working on making reviews, such as video game reviews with Dr. Groovy Gamiac. Just reviewing those groovy games. The title itself is Groovy Games with... Dr. Groovy Gamiac. Oh yeah! So, I'm certainly going to be getting a different outfit for him. And you can thank Jitterbug Jive for coming up with the idea for the new name, rather than Mr. Good Game. I was so set on the idea of using the phrase, Good Game, I didn't take the time to look up adjectives that would probably be a better fit for... A character that would have been a bit more generic. So Jitters had suggested Groovy Gamer and I was thinking ooh that sounds good. So I went with that for a little bit, decided to look up different adjectives and Groovy just stuck the best. But I was thinking of what else I could do and what would really stick out. So then Jitters suggested Dr. Groovy Gamiac. So, Doctor would be a little, hey, here's a nudge to a role I've done before. On a particular Pockets channel, Pennies with Pockets, in the audio play, Hooves and Assistant. It's a very fun series, I do recommend watching it. It has a lot of cast and crew that put their hearts into it, and it is really good. I love it. I love being a part of it. It is awesome. Avante! So, anyways... That will be uh, just a little idea of what's going to be happening with the review side of things on the Total Game X channel. But that also includes other type of scripted videos, which may likely be parody of video games. Whether it be Five Nights at Freddy's, Undertale, Mario Brothers, I'll figure it out. I'll see what just works and seems the best suited for whatever's going on or whatever feels the most fun. So, that's something to look forward to. 
And again, I will be focusing that channel on also playing games with other people, which is what online Game Yax is for. Online Game Yax is a way that I can play with you guys in a game and stream it on Twitch to be put here on YouTube on the Total Game Yax channel. So that's kind of the idea with Total Game Yax. Total Game Yax was originally myself, Jitterbug Jive, and my little, bro little brother Tyler. So it was going to be the three of us doing that hosting thing, but a lot of different stuff has been going on. We've kind of been going different directions, but still staying together. That's why I was coming up with ideas for other segments within Total Game X. Total Game X is still the heart of the idea of playing games together because it's a little bit of a pun because Total Game X. It's where it's the total being Gamiax. Kind of like you would usually see on a Sonic game, for example, back in the old days or the 90s. Dude. Yeah, that's kind of, that was a little bit of the ideas. W wait, I can make something punny. And that just kind of came up. It's not like a super humorous pun, but it's there. And Gamiax was just a thing where I thought... What can I come up with that's a good title for someone who does gaming and loves it? Gamiac! And some of you might be thinking Animaniacs with Total Gamiacs, but I'm going a little bit off topic. So that will be it for Total Gamiacs. So lastly, I will touch on the My Little Buggy channel. And what that entails still will be furry, brony, and animation fandom focus videos. A lot of those will be, again, fandom-centric. It won't be so much like the general personal side of the Jester Diorama channel. So any type of commentary I may have on a fandom situation or show or maybe sometimes... No, it wouldn't be a game. Games would still be for Total Game Yax, so commentaries for video games would likely be on the Total Game Yax channel. But... Anything that has to do with like the furry, brony, or animation stuff, or just, you know, a variety of fandom stuff, that will just all be the focus of My Little Buggy. And I do want to add that my art will actually be going over to the My Little Buggy channel, because a lot of what I do is fandom related for different animations, or the furry, or brony fandoms. So that's going to be the, the channel in which my art will be posted and shared. So that would include single images and comics, such as the comics I have on Tumblr for Bubbleberry Answers and Ask Mad Dr. Hooves and A Serial Dreamer. And I do want to add that if you ever do want to find any of my art, most of it is put up, well, if not all of it, uh, is put up on my Jester Tumblr, but I do have specific blogs I can give you guys in the description that will say, hey, this is the place to go to for art of so-and-so content. So if you ever want to go like to find out more, just go to jester.tumblr.com and I'll be able to say, hey, yeah, you can go over to this blog, like jest-art.tumblr.com. And that's mainly where my art stuff goes for the general stuff. Not safe for work, that's to a not safe for work blog because, you know, there's supposed to be a separation with those things. So, if you ever want to find out about my content, you can always ask me here or on Tumblr, or even Twitter, for example, on Jester Dayrama. And, yeah, I forgot to add that you guys may already know, my Twitch is always Jester underscore Dayrama, and you can always find me there when I'm doing any editing or art, maybe, or even games, because that's kind of what I wanted to use the channel for on Twitch, to share and enjoy a lot of various content in one place. YouTube, you can't do that because YouTube is more along the lines of you need to have subjects for your channels. If it's Twitch, you can do almost anything in one place. 
YouTube, it doesn't work like that with the algorithms because if you guys don't see video after video after video from me, the algorithm will make my videos drop from your viewing areas or wherever you want to, whatever you want to describe for, you know, these little videos on the side. It's pretty much you have to watch me consistently in order to make sure my stuff shows up in your dashboard. And that's not very nice for YouTube to do, but we gotta adapt and do what we can, and maybe actually having specific subjects on YouTube is a better idea because it allows users to go, hey, this channel is doing something specifically that I like watching. I'm gonna subscribe to them. And that's perfectly okay. And yeah, I was originally thinking, my Jester Dorama channel was going to be the Variety channel, but that wasn't quite working out. And maybe actually separating things will make things a little bit easier. So there's that. And if I didn't say so already, there will also be commentaries related to possibly fandom subjects or fandom drama. And those will be touched on appropriately with research appropriate to whatever the subject is. So there's that. And I hope you guys look forward to whatever is to come. So, other than that, that would be about it. And I want to thank you guys for watching through. And I hope to see you guys in future content as I get more active. Well, more active after the move. And I will be moving again at the beginning of August. So, I will see you guys still this month on streams and some videos. But, it won't be as active as it could be. So, as always, praise the spurple, and no matter the time of day, if I don't see you, you have a good morning, a good afternoon, a good evening, and good night. See you next time. Love you lots. Bye.